this is the entrance of the Yosemite. We already made a reservation online and we paid online. It used to be like we can go in without any reservation, but after this pandemic happens, they limit the people who can enter the park. So we need to make a reservation in advance. And it is really competitive. Hi. Hello. Sure. You guys want a mapping guide? Uh, yeah, please. Take papers or permits, stick that to your window, lower left hand side. Okay. Okay, got it. Alright, Jose, take care. You too, thanks. As you can see, the air quality was pretty bad on this day because of the wildfire currently happening around the Yosemite Valley. Usually, you can see entire Yosemite Valley from here. We move back to the entrance area of the park. And we decided to eat lunch here by the river because air quality was better. Because of the air quality, we decided to go back to the hotel this day. Hopefully tomorrow will be gets better. The first spot of the day is Glacier Point. The air quality is better than yesterday. It seems like the elevation is higher the better. So this is a famous and popular half dome. It looks like I put some filter on it. But I didn't, it's just a haze from the wide fire. And we decided to go to a short hike, it's only a 2 mile hike, it shouldn't be a difficult one. And we're gonna hike to the waterfall, let's go! You shouldn't take this trial. I'm serious. How many points out of 10? Zero out of 10. So this is our last spot for the Yosemite trip. So it was a bit smoky that we expected because of the wildfire currently happening in the San Francisco Bay Area. But like we went to Glacier Point and it was 
amazing. The view was amazing. So we plan to stay here tonight, but we decided to leave early. So we're gonna leave Yosemite tonight and heading home. But we definitely have to come back here and I'm excited for the next trip in Yosemite. And I will take you guys with me at that time. So thank you very much for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I will see you soon.